All right, so this is a mess, but what it also is, is a Moto Energy, Moto Energy ME 1003, <clears throat> coupled to the factory five speed in this 91 Suzuki Swift GTI. Kelly controller waterproof with regen brushed motor. Um, why is it like this? Good question. It needs a third engine mount. This is where we'll third engine mount two. We need Ben over at Next Level Motors to fabricate. I need something from there. <clears throat> so here to somewhere because this is all wibbly wobbly. Um, I inherited slash bought this product project and uh, it's been sort of sitting here for a year waiting for me to get my ass in gear and uh, I did finally get it in gear because this is the new battery pack. BMS, very temporarily, set up with very temporary wires so that we can monitor temperatures, charging and discharging each cell, getting them balanced. This should be good enough to get me over to the next level. The plan is to have the batteries mounted under the hood, but currently there's nothing to mount them to. And once there's a way to keep the motor and transmission from moving around, as well as a place for the steady bearing to actually connect to, something up here then batteries will go here get encapsulated get heating mats underneath and this should be a runabout with top speed in the 80 to 110 kilometers an hour range depending on tire size and depending on how much rpm i can get out of this motor it's rated from between 2800 rpm loaded to 3700 rpm unloaded and i just don't know what I'll be able to see out of it, if that's 2,800 or if that's more. And here's Aaron. These are the batteries that used to be in it. These are 15 year old AGMs with uh, varying degrees of ability and voltage. Currently using a lead acid charger actually to shunt voltage into the BMS. I have a 15 amp charger that my friend is working on fixing for me. Um, for some reason it wasn't working when we tested it last time, but this should get me F, F, this should get me enough juice. All right, it's been charging a little bit here, and I think we are ready to try and limp it over to next level motors. That's the controller. It's not completely always connected because I don't have a main disconnect for it so now it's just sort of in there all right so this is theoretically a car now which means it can theoretically do car things <clears throat> all right so key on that's cool that's a uh, RPM, that's the motor. We got lights if we want, I'm not gonna use lights. Okay, I'm gonna put it in reverse, no clutch. And that's it, I'm driving it. We are slowly driving. Slowly but surely, backing up. That's my friend Aaron, he's gonna follow me over there. He loves you. And we are gonna try and go. So, second gear, and go. Try and go, okay. So, currently discharging, you know, 16 amps, whatever, normal stuff. Third gear. Okay, cool. Super nifty. Driving on lithium power for the very first time. Okay, second gear. Taking off from a light here. Gonna very gently accelerate, trying to stay under 100 amps. Get some speed going. 
because we need to get up to speed. Okay, that's 40 kilometers an hour. 40, all right, second, forty, the fourth gear. Okay, we are going 50 kilometers an hour. I don't think I've ever gone this fast in this car. Wow. So this is the coolest shit. Um, it is working, I've got my live amp meter. I've got my digital amp meter here. And if I let off, it starts charging. I got regen, oh, it's not showing now. Oh yeah, but there, it went positive for a second. It does regenerate, it is working. It is dope. So we've made it about, I don't know, 20% of the way there. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Um, I hit 120 amps, flooring it only 10, 20%, who knows, going up the hill, big hill. I didn't really uh, like that very much. That's because I don't know this battery pack and I don't know this BMS. And the engine's not, or the motor's not attached to very much except for ratchet straps. So I'm not trying to apply very much torque at all to anything. I am just trying very gently to move along. And going about 50 kilometers an hour, who knows how many RPM, I am only drawing 30 some amps. Like it is really dick all that this car takes to move. It is amazing. So there you go, there's a little amp meter, it's my volt meter, always pegged because it only goes to 60. Pretty stupid. That's it, it's, it's fantastic. Gonna just start in second here like a normal person, or fourth, I guess this is fourth. Yeah, this, this is fourth, we're just starting in fourth like completely normal people. <sighs> completely normal people starting fourth gear, only the most normal. I really want to try and show the regen. Uh, I'm so surprised that it works. Uh, it's just really, really cool seeing current. No, yeah, it's positive. Going back into the battery, slowing down here. Charging the battery with more amps than I ever have. Uh, the, the shitty charger I've got only does 2, 2.6. So this is literally magic. Magic. All right, so we are almost at the top of the hill. Here's my friend. We're going in here, we're going left. And uh, I can't fucking leave it. Like I just drove this car on these janky batteries clear across Calgary. This is magic. Not a real, no any problems. I get the battery voltage is still nominally pretty high. Uh, yeah. Yeah. This is it's nifty. This is really nifty. Almost at next level motors. This is so cool. Regenerating all the way here. So cool. Alright. Made it to where we need to go. Next level. First burnout in this car ever. Oh, with the other tire. <laughs> 